say it does not really matter what time day or night that you listen to the on god podcast daily devotions now this is half of your host which you know as randy aka lz um we're doing um second part of um false prophets and false teachers um i want to continue reading um there's still more scriptures that i found um which i believe will help us towards this conversation and understanding and grasping the concept of false teachers and false prophets and how to deal with them um today let's read from matthew chapter 16 verse 11 to 12 um how is it you don't understand that I was not talking to you about bread? But be on your guard against the yeast of the Pharisees and the Sadducees. I don't know if I'm reading that right, but it is what it is. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. Like, apologies if I'm wrong. Um, 12 reads, and Then they understood that he was not telling them to guard against the yeast used in bread, but against the teaching of the Pharisees and seduces again correct me if i'm wrong i apologize if i'm wrong i don't know how to read that um second timothy chapter 4 verse 3 to 4 for the time will come when people will not put up with sound doctrine Mm, i cannot wait for that time oh i cannot wait for that time instead to suit their own desires they will gather around them a great number of teachers to say what their itching ears want to hear Mm. they will gather around them a great number of teachers to say what their itching ears want to hear they will turn their ears away from the truth and turn aside to myths uh wow uh Acts chapter 20 verse 28 to 30. Um, Keep watch over yourselves and all the flock of which the Holy Spirit has made you overseers. Be shepherds of the church of God which he bought with his own blood. I know that after I leave savage wolves will come in among you and will not spare the flock. Even from your own number men will arise and distort the truth in order to draw away disciples after them Mm. okay oh (laughs) this is so beautiful man um second peter chapter 3 verse 14 to 18 it reads so then dear friends since you are looking forward to this make every effort to be found spotless blameless and at peace with him Bear in mind that our Lord's patience means salvation, just as our dear brother Paul also wrote you with the wisdom that God gave him. He writes the same way in all his letters, speaking in them of these matters. His letters contain some things that are hard to understand, which ignorant and unstable people distort, as they do the other scriptures to their own destruction. Therefore, dear friends, since you have been forewarned be on your guard so that you may not be carried away by the error of the lawless and fall from your secure position but grow in the grace and knowledge of our lord savior jesus christ to him be glory both now and forever (sighs) amen excuse me um i wanna end off there for today um these beautiful scriptures man, are so perfect even better than yesterday thank you lord for such an amazing word Ooh, for the time will come when people will not put up with sound doctrine 
Instead, they, to suit their own desires, they will gather around them a great number of teachers to say what their itching ears want to hear. They will turn their ears away from the truth and turn aside to myths. Guys, guys, the end time man, is here and the Bible tells us like from back then, from back then, it's speaking about now. Because we're seeing these things right now. People are turning away from sound doctrine. People are turning away from the word. People say use um, false prophets and false teachers as an excuse not to serve God. And I want to tell you guys, stop. Because God is the truth. Actually, Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. It's the only way, okay? so you cannot live this life without him heavenly father thank you for your word thank you for your grace thank you for sound doctrine thank you for the truth we thank you for your life thank you for showing us the way because you are an amazing god and which is why we serve you because you are our maker and you call us friend i thank you i thank you my beloved, I love you so much, Father. I love you so much.